latitude and longitude. What can we learn from a globe? A globe is a picture of a planet, which is drawn on a sphere. It is like a scale model of the planet. One can learn about different countries, formation of bodies of water, mountain ranges, natural resources, and also things like, latitude and longitude. Latitude and longitude are part of the geographic coordinate system and they help us to map every point on the globe. Latitude represents the coordinates going horizontally around the globe whereas longitude represents the coordinates going vertically. So, pay attention, latitude's lines are the black ones and longitude lines are the red ones. Latitude is an invisible horizontal line that runs around the Earth from east to west. It begins at the equator where its coordinates are zero degrees. The equator divides the Earth into the northern and southern hemispheres. The lines of latitude run parallel to the equator in both the northern and southern hemispheres, starting at zero degrees and counting to 90 degrees north and 90 degrees south. Longitude is the invisible vertical line that runs around the Earth from north to south. The prime meridian is where its coordinates are zero degrees. Longitude divides the globe into the eastern and western hemispheres along the prime meridian. Imagine you're going on a trip to London and your friend wants to find it on a map, but has no idea where it is. You could tell your friend the latitude and longitude, and your friend would be able to easily locate London on the map. Latitude and longitude are imaginary lines that help you find the location of anywhere in the world on a map. So you can easily find London location through them. But guys, remember, that all the longitudes are of the exact length, but latitudes get smaller and smaller as we move away from the equator, which is the longest latitude. Considering the expanse of the Earth can you imagine how much area will be enclosed by the quadrilateral formed by the two successive latitudes and longitudes? That means the area enclosed between the equator and the latitude 1 degree north and prime, meridian and the 1 degree east longitude? It will be huge. But as one moves towards the poles this area becomes lesser and will have only a point at the pole which is 90 degrees north latitude and point of intersection of all the longitudes. Now it has become even easier due to GPS. Now we can easily know our exact location in terms of latitude and longitude using our mobile phones. Now you are able to find your friend's location through latitude and longitude. Also UCN helped a lost people using jeeps, latitude and longitude. Latitude and longitude are your helpers to search locations. The end. Thanks for watching.